on the new Talk Radio 1450 WCTC. Call Jersey Central at 732-545-9282. Toll free at 888-545-9282. Watch Jersey Central live online at WCTCAM.com or listen on your smartphone with the iHeartRadio or TuneIn apps. Connect with WCTC on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and YouTube by searching 1450 WCTC. And now back to Jersey's Morning Show. Jersey Central with Burt Barrett. 838 back on Jersey Central on the new talk radio 1450 WCTC, the voice of Central Jersey. Hello once again from inside the Ford's Jewelers Studios. We got our need to know things coming up in just a few moments. The last couple of weeks, we've had some experts here on the show, mostly tech experts and talking about some of the electronic goodies and gadgets that will make some great gifts for the holiday season. Maybe you want to go in a different direction, and we'll do that here. Maybe you're looking for some simple, cost-friendly, do-it-yourself tips when it comes to decorating, hosting, or gift-giving, of course, for the holiday season. I cannot think of anybody better to have than uh, television hosts and do-it-yourself design experts who are here. Ben and Aaron Napier, who are joining me on the Jersey Central uh, Newsmaker Hotline. Good morning to uh, to you guys. How are you today? Good morning. Good, morning. Good, morning. Doing all right? Good to have you both here with us here. Where are you guys from, first of all? Where do you call home? Mississippi. Yeah. Laurel, yeah. Mississippi. Beautiful. What are some uh, holiday traditions that you guys uh, enjoy there in Mississippi? We love to do as much as we can with our family so that it's not just like time spent at the mall and time spent at the grocery store. Get the things you need and then go home and do things with your family because that's what they're going to remember forever. It's not the gifts as much as the time spent together. So, like, my mom and I love to bake together, and we don't do it for, you know, just every part of the year. It's just the holidays. It seems like we get together and we bake cookies or cinnamon rolls. We roast pecans. We put them in vintage Christmas tins and give those as gifts, like, to the neighborhood or you know, the friends that um, maybe weren't expecting a little something at Christmas, surprise them with something like a little box of cookies. Such a nice, simple idea, but sometimes we just get co- so caught up in our everyday lives, Ben, that, you know what, we have to remember that at the end of the day, it's about family and about the special people in our lives. Yeah, that's uh, for, for us, it's, it's more than just doing things that you're supposed to do at the holidays. Like, it's it's you know, doing things with your family when it comes to decorating, when it comes to wrapping presents. You know, you can have wrapping parties. And Erin actually likes to, uh, we wrap with just craft paper, which you get at your local hardware store. And um, then, you know, it's real simple and plain looking, but you can decorate it however you want with twine or ribbon or Erin, you know, being married to an artist the way I am. Um, she likes to draw pictures and and write notes on them. I do little doodles of the person I'm giving the gift to. No way. The, wow. Yeah. That's cool. So Real it, cool. It, you know, it's, it makes it a little more personal that way, and it's just as festive and just as beautiful as if you had gone to, you know, your local store and bought the wrapping paper. Yeah, but um, you could do that with kids, too. It's really fun. Give kids markers. Say, you know, draw Grandma on the gift wrap. <laughs> like, and Grandmother might even frame the gift wrap because that's more special to her than whatever's inside. That's the thing that we try to focus on it around yeah. the holidays. And that way you're, you're getting the things done that you need to get done for the holidays, but then you're getting the things done that are important, which are, you know, spending time with your family. And you're not breaking the bank when you do that. Yeah, you that, know, that's the important thing. I mean, for the ultimate, right. uh, ultimate do-it-yourselfers uh, like you two are, uh, what, what materials, what should we have around the house if someone wants to do some do-it-yourself uh, holiday projects? Uh, ben, what do you recommend we start with? Uh, we keep we always keep twine around the house. I mean, there's so many different projects you can do. Um, Erin, she likes to uh, hang our cards from, a, you know, I'll, I'll take a big frame and we'll just string twine back and forth between it, and she'll hang cards from that. Um, you know, keep tape handy, keep, you know, paper. Yeah, the brown ribbon. craft paper is really handy to have all season long. And then you can go out in your backyard or run down to the store in a city like New York. You run down to the store, you pick up little bits of evergreen, limbs, berries. You can make centerpieces at the last minute when you got company coming over. You don't have to fuss over your decor. Just let it be natural. Let it be simple. Simple, yeah. And then that way it's, it's beautiful and it's things you can do with your family. You can make your own decorations and make your own gifts. And um, it, it ends up being time spent with family while also preparing your home and your gifts for those 
you those that you love. Yeah, anytime you can give somebody that something that's got this very unique sort of personal touch to it, I think that's something that really resonates well with people. So uh, great ideas here for the ultimate do-it-yourselfers, and uh, there's some really, really good ideas there. Uh, how important is, uh, is a holiday budget, Erin? Uh, uh, what, what kind of budget do you set for the holidays? It's really important for me to make a list of everyone that I need to give a gift to and then, you know, try to set – a realistic budget that's not breaking the bank and then stick to it. Um, the sticking to it is maybe harder in some cases, but another way we really love to save money is using the Bank of America card because you get 1% cash back on all purchases. So the hardware store, the craft store, 1% cash back, 2% cash back at groceries, um, at the grocery stores and wholesale clubs. And then for us, who, you know, we live in Mississippi and my brothers live, you know, hours away and um, when we travel to see family, you get 3% cash back on your gas. So um, anytime you can you can save money, it's great. And anytime you can get money back, that's even better. Yeah, always is. Uh, ben, where can we catch you guys uh, on television? Where can I watch you guys and, and check out your show? Uh, it'll be on HGTV. The show's called Hometown. Okay. Uh, but yeah. if, if you go to bankofamerica.com slash get cash back, you can read all about you know our tips and everything and um, learn a little bit more about us. Excellent. Yeah, I'm intrigued now to, to learn a little bit more about your show. Uh, Aaron, let's say, for example, you're having, uh, I don't know, you and Ben were going to host, I don't know, uh, a guy from New Jersey, and he was going to come <laughs> down and spend some time with you. What, what kind of uh, what kind of meal would you serve uh, in Mississippi there for a guy from the Northeast? Oh, man, are you kidding? Fried turkey, hello. Fried uh, turkey, okay. Yes, fried All turkey right. is the best. <laughs> right. And then dressing, not stuffing. Yeah, Eat we do cornbread, cornbread dressing <laughs> instead of stuffing. That so. sounds delicious. Yeah. Cornbread yeah. dressing. That sounds wonderful. Yeah. Wow. Awesome. Well, good stuff. Listen, thanks for the time today. Happy Thanksgiving to the both of you guys. And uh, I'll be sure. looking for you on, on television, all right? All right. All right thank thanks, you so Bert. much. Great to speak with you. Thank you. All right. Ben and Aaron Napier. Yeah, TV stars. The ultimate uh, do it yourself